Oh, so we're suddenly handing out Neymar comparisons like candy at a parade, huh? I mean, does Mikey Moore have a glittering collection of accolades hidden away in a secret vault? Or is he just really, really good at dribbling past defenders while everyone else is still figuring out which way to run? I guess if you manage to annoy a few seasoned pros while still wearing shin guards, you find yourself in the spotlight faster than you can say, Neymar Jr. So, let's talk about the rave reviews. Apparently, one impressive performance in the Europa League is all it takes to be dubbed the next big thing. Isn't that adorable? One day, you're playing Fortnite with friends, and the next, you're being told to channel your inner Brazilian superstar. Welcome to the whirlwind of sports fame, where a few slick moves can morph you from a bench warmer to the next elite baller, with just a sprinkle of fairy dust and some good old social media clout. It's amazing how quickly people forget the realities of football. One backflip and a couple of slick moves, and suddenly he's dragging a comparison to a world-renowned player. Not to mention when we start talking about the pressure of expectations. Hope he's ready for that because if he doesn't replicate these stellar performances consistently, you know the football critics will be waiting with their pitchforks, ready to roast him to a crisp faster than they would a veggie burger at a barbecue. And can someone tell me how a teenager suddenly triggers the imaginations of fans and pundits alike? It's like they've all collectively decided that they need a new poster child for their walls. And who better than a fresh-faced Tottenham lad? I mean, why settle for reality when you can craft a narrative filled with dreamy assists and dazzling goals? If this kid doesn't suit up for Brazil in the near future, can we at least consider adopting some of that Neymar energy for ourselves? Asking for a friend. Let's not kid ourselves, though. Neymar has been like, what did I do to deserve this in the back of his mind? Poor guy probably just wants to enjoy his weekly dance-offs and, you know, not deal with any teenage comparisons. But here we are, proving once again that football fans can romanticize an average Tuesday into a blockbuster story, all based on a couple of fancy footwork moments. Someone should really direct this as a motivational movie. So here's the million dollar question. Is Mikey Moore actually that good, or are we just tired of living in a world where it takes years to build a reputation? Talk about a fast track. Maybe we should all take a note from Mikey. Why wait for quality skills when you can shell out a few sweet spin moves, throw in a cheeky smile, and bam, you're a star overnight. Who knew you could become famous just by having fun and enjoying the game? But hey, I've got to ask, as you witness this whirlwind of comparisons and rapidly growing expectations for young Mikey Moore, have you started questioning your own life choices? Sitting on the couch eating chips while he dances his way into football stardom? I mean, was it time wasted while he was acquiring such talent? Or do you think we can all just get by with our own little version of Neymar magic in our mundane lives? Let's hear your thoughts. Like and subscribe, please.